Hey, what's up guys? It's Rob from Instinct Bass. I'm back here with another video. Hey, wanted to show you something that I figured out the other day. Um, so I launched at this lake and it's really shallow and my transducer came off when I launched. Found it floating in the back. Um, so I, I put it in a compartment and went back home and reinstalled it. And ever since then, you can see my side view is only showing the left side. And I figured out a fix for it finally. I, one, I made sure the transducer was level. You know, you should always do that. So I did that. That didn't really seem to fix it. Um, and you know, I really thought I was just gonna have to buy another transducer. And, and I may still have to do that, but I did figure out a way to fix this. Um, I went in and I reset the unit and that actually fixed it. But I don't think resetting it is, is what you have to do. I think resetting it did what I'm about to show you. Um, but you don't have to go through the actual process of resetting the whole unit. So as you can see, my my frequency is set to 1120. Um, if you go in here and set that frequency to 455, watch what happens. Look, my other side came back. So I don't know why that happened. Um, I'm going to start the motor up because side view doesn't look good unless you're moving. But as you can see, you know, I got side view again. Um, now, I would like to have it at that 1120 kilohertz just because it gives me a little clearer picture. But, you know, 455 is better than, than half the screen. So just thought I'd throw that out there in case you run into that issue. Try that before you go and buy a new fish finder, uh, or I should say a new transducer. Um, and at least that'll get you by for a little while. Hopefully I won't have to buy one for quite a while or, uh, you know, until I replace this unit or something like that. But uh, just a quick tip, and I hope it helps you out. Thanks a lot.